tried out, but only 16 made it to Nashville. Who will get to live their gospel dream? I'm Kelly Sutton, and it's rehearsal day here on the set of Gospel Dream. Our nationwide talent search has brought 16 super talented singers to Music City. It's going to be a tough, emotional week for all of them as they try to avoid elimination. Here's how some of the contestants got ready for the competition. I would sing to and from work every day, so I had about an hour and a half every day to sing. Well, I always tend to forget my words, so I went over and over and over the song and over again. A lot of prayer. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of prayer. <laughs> To prepare, I have listened to my songs a thousand gazillion times on my MP3 player. I have my Bose headphones, so today I did For Every Mountain. So I've been listening to For Every Mountain all morning long. You know, some of the things that I did um, in preparation for this um, competition was to just take care of my vocal cords, you know, drinking a lot of liquids, no fried foods, you know, even fasting before I got here, um, you know, worshiping God, praising God for who He is, and just really staying focused. Well, actually, I got up really early this morning and, and did like 45 minutes of cardio, <laughs> just trying to get my, my, my tension and my, my nerves out, So, which helped until I got here. Praise and worship leader Martha Munizzi will be one of the Gospel Dream judges this year, and she has some words of wisdom for the Sweet 16. I would just tell them to sing from their heart and just know that you're really singing for an audience of one, and, and that's the Lord, that's Jesus. So just give us all you got. The Gospel Dream champion wins a record and music video deal as well as a Royal Caribbean cruise. Don't miss the world premiere of Gospel Dream 2008, June 1st at 9 p.m. Eastern, right here on Gospel Music Channel. I'm Kelly Sutton.